This could be good for me Lately I was feeling like I need a purpose But when you talk to me Give me the impression that I won't scratch your surface And I could walk for days Searching for a break to find Is there a chance for me To clean your memories Will I still lose my mind Hey besties, happy Tuesday. I'm about to go to town and shop for beddings from mattress cover, uh, bed sheets, duvet cover and pillowcases to add up to what I already have. I want to buy these other mattress covers from Mtumba so I'm going to Mtumba to buy uh, like two or three mattress covers and then that waterproof mattress cover from my shop and then duvet covers and more bed sheets and pillowcases new ones brand new from a shop so from tumba i'm only going to get the other kind of the other type of uh, mattress cover and then the heat in nakuru right now guys the heat outside there is too much i had to put on this off shoulder and then now that i only have cornrows on my head i had to push back this wig so that it doesn't cover my face because i'm already sweating and i'm not even out there so i don't know how it's gonna be because i'm also going to go from one shop to another i'm also going to window shop and if possible purchase a laptop I've been weighing between buying in Nakuru and Nairobi and I'm just confused. So if I'll find something that I really, really want, I'm going to buy from Nakuru. Just that I won't settle for what I don't want. I have to find exactly what I want. So far, I've been researching online from Nakuru. I can't find nothing. But from Nairobi, I've been searching online. I've found a variety. In fact, I'm so spoiled for choice. But then I'm like, do I really have to travel to Nairobi for me? Me to buy a laptop a laptop but i don't know i'm going to window shop and i'll take you guys with me if possible if they allow filming and then yeah give me the impression that i won't scratch your surface and i could walk for days searching for your praise but is it even there to find from me to clean your memories will I slowly lose my mind will I slowly this is where I bought my TV the high sense shop home guys and i want to show you what i've been able to purchase so let me start with whatever I bought that i had not planned to buy but i bought anyway <laughs> within the hassles of looking for where to purchase the duvet covers and bed sheets i got myself into good shops and i made some 
purchases so um i bought another decor book I already have the Chanel Decker book that I bought from Nairobi. And for the same price that I bought the other one from Nairobi. This one is Givenchy. I already have Chanel. So bought these at 800 bob. And then I bought this egg tray. Uh, it carries 35 eggs. I wanted to buy this from Nairobi um, and it was going for 1100 bob. The page I actually DM'd to buy from yesterday afternoon, they delayed to reply but they were selling it for 1100 bob. I wanted them delivered today and because they kind of delayed to reply, I let it go. And then today, I bought this one at 950. They've even written here, 950. Imagine randomly, I had not even planned. It's 950. The other one was 1100 bob plus, um, you know, delivery fee. It's also there. So, this is actually a steal. Wow, this one has just motivated me to buy eggs. So, I'm going to buy my Kenyaji eggs from a home nearby. And then I bought this one finally. I wanted to buy these ones I think a month ago I was asking for direction on where I can buy them on my IG they recommended Nivas I went to Nivas I didn't find but today where I bought this Deca book in fact I bought all this at the same place so I bought these two and I've already cleaned this one and used it to drink my yogurt I came home so hungry bought this one at 350 each uh, I think 350 each, such a thing. This one is 950. And then I finally bought um, <clears throat> I finally bought flowers for my vest. I bought these flowers for my ceramic vest. This cute ceramic vest that I bought from Nairobi. I bought these three white flowers, which are long, but they are foldable. So I'm just going to fold them. think they are so perfect here bought each branch at 80 bob they were 100 bob but i bargained <laughs> yeah i think that's all that i bought from that shop and then now i started hustling for bed sheets i wanted to buy those mtumba um mattress covers zile za kuingiza tu then it's ball unaingiza tu mattress ndani i couldn't okay i found i found some but me make a layer rice. I'm so hungry. I wanted to buy those ones. I found some, but they were not as good as I wanted them. So I passed. I feel like I'm still going to buy more beddings as time goes. Also needed a white uh, duvet. I didn't find because these ones here are 6x6. Six six, so I need to change my duvet too. So where I bought these ones, um, <clears throat> the building next to Lydia Caird. The building next to Lydia Caird. That corridor, Ukingia Tunayo Corridor. East side the Kenyatta Avenue, in the corridor, the building next to Lydia Ked on your right. Utapata two shop one uza po deca items. I paid by my phone, so I'll look for their name and attach here so that you guys can be guided in case you want to go there to purchase your stuff. So these ones are basically a set of one one duvet cover, one duvet cover, one bed sheet and two pillowcases okay the quality is actually better than what i have already 
Nilikuwa na mwambia oh, ni zile light sijui nini. Yeah. This is actually high quality than what I have. I want them washed tomorrow so I can tell. But this is the four more quality than Na huyo mtu aliniambia this one huwezi pata yenye ni better than this. Nikamwambia mm hizi si niko nazo nyumbani. Niliosha mara moja zikakaa very light. This is actually good this is actually good uh, cotton. Wait. Wait. This is actually so so good. So this is the bed sheet and then this is you see even the way they have stitched this zipper, the duvet cover zipper, I can tell that this is actually good quality. You guys, I'm going to give you directions to this shop. Thank God Nilichkwa Nambayake because they said they bring white duvets. So I had to take their number. Look at the stitching. I'm just comparing it to my um to the set that I already have here in the house. I have such a set. Oh my god, I think I'm going back to buy more. I'm therefore going back to buy more. Na pilo kese sisi kwa api. Mwa kusema. Oh, ndo hizi. Ah, I love this quality. Ah, this is actually cotton. Now imagine they sell these things on wholesale. This this one set, the one to recover one bed sheet and two pillowcases, twenty one hundred. I bargained down to two thousand bob. So for the two sets, I bought them for four thousand bob. If people could see quality through Nini, oh god, I can't wait for them to be washed so that I can tell. If this is actually what I think, because if that's it, then I'm going back for more. So my bed is a five by six, but I bought um six by six because I want to tuck in very very well. I want to tuck in very very well, and even for the duvet, I want a bigger one that when I spread the bed, I can get some hanging on the sides. And then I went to Mtumba um Vileni Nikosa the other do the other the other mattress cover ilea kuingiza hivi. I still got this one in Ilea Ikona elastic huku kando. This is also a six by six because I didn't find a five by six. Otherwise this one I'd have just taken a five by six because I want it to fit perfectly. But I made sure that it's thick enough. The corner is as thick as my mattress. So yeah. I also bought these from Tumba at 450 bob. From 550 to 450 bob. Yeah, trust me when it comes to bargaining. Even though it's light, that's why I actually even bargained. But yes, besties, so this is everything from town. Every Okay, with this avocado. Imagine, yeah. I just went to shop... Uh, for the bedding, very I was very specific. Um, also went window shopped on a laptop. You guys, by the way, I'm sorry, besties. A moment, please, please, please. Before I give you guys a rant, I have a small rant up on Bele. But before that, this is me coming to you in the middle of the night. It's around 11 p.m. in the night. I've just finished editing this video, and then I've realized that it's one of those short videos I give you straight to the point. And then I thought to myself, why not, you know, plug you guys to another bestie that you can watch. Her name is Rania Anwar. I don't want to mispronounce that name. That's her name. She's a Muslim. I'm not just saying she's a Muslim for no good reason. It's because to me, she's a breath of fresh air when I watch her. The way she does her things, you know. She does lifestyle vlogs with her family, her and her husband. I've seen the two of them mostly in her vlogs. And I just love, I just love the simplicity of her life. The simplicity of her vlogs. So yeah, I'm here to plug you guys to another bestie go and check out these people they are my subscribers and they support me too so please i'll always attach a card either here or here 
just somewhere just click on the card and then go and check her out and support them one good thing is that i recommend people who are relatable to my content too that way i know that when you go to check them out you love them and then you'll stick with them so mimi my night is just beginning I'm yet to go. I want to upload this video and still, you know, work some more. I'm not overworking. I had a good rest during the day. Just that I'm team uh, night all. Okay, back to our rant. And thank you so much for listening. I've window shopped from two major uh, laptop shops that were highly recommended by my uh, Instagram fam. And I didn't find any single laptop that had all the specs that i wanted i'm looking for an x uk laptop because for the specs that i'm looking for if i go for a brand new one i'll have to go for a good 150k and above but for an x uk and the specs that i want i can get a laptop up to 80,000 bob and that's what i have so i'm thinking of going to nairobi to purchase a laptop but i'm just wondering what kind of life is this like i have to travel to buy a laptop i'm also thinking of using a friend you know uh making one of my friends a shopper pay her something and then she'll go purchase for me and then i'm also wondering something like a laptop why should i send someone and then i also hate traveling it's it's just a lot i'm actually low-key stressed up by this i just want to purchase this laptop once and for all and forget everything honestly but yeah i'll just see what to do yeah so yeah that's it guys that's it this vlog is all about beddings i don't want to make it about any other thing so in fact i'm going to edit it tonight so that i upload it tomorrow and for that reason i'll see you guys in my next vlog let me go and eat my rice cook it and eat because yogurt cg men up i'm so hungry but i didn't have breakfast i uh -uh, actually had breakfast i had some i had some leftovers from yesterday yeah see you guys he never answers me when i call him makes me feel so